we freaking roll. <laughs> Good morning everyone how are you all doing welcome back to my channel so today is the third day in Rome you're about to see some of the things that you've been seeing on your Instagram some of the things that you've been seeing trending we're gonna check them out today so before further ado please make sure to hit that subscribe button so you do not miss out on any any other videos also make sure to go check out other videos that I've previously shared on Italy. Let's go guys. Let's go start the day and have some fun. said that if you throw a coin in the fountain you will come back to Rome so let's see if it's gonna happen so, guys this is the reality of the situation let me show you look at the crowds Where? this is the place made I think so it looks fancy and stuff this is Benchy guys so I think this is the place like it's so cute here so you can just get all the goody goody stuff all the chocolate at uh, the temple of Adriano free entrance Guys, um, this is the situation. There's long, long queues just going into the Pantheon. But if you have time, I suggest just going early so that you don't have to spend time in the queues. So yeah, that's the situation. You can also go on a horse if you're feeling like romantic -y and all. Here's to the good days, here's to the sorrows. This is a okay, look at this little one. It's so nice because literally it was packed here and it actually fits. So, Steak. I know about tomorrow. I don't want to fight no more because I don't feel the need no more. No, just want to make it. I don't know if you can see but here there's just two uh, like fire burning this in there and uh, we can actually go up maybe it's something in the water or maybe we just hit the end of the road right now it doesn't even matter it's too late not to live Babe, do you see the cars down there? Come see. Oh. is our ticket is for 320 and now it's about uh, 2 230 I think 230 
So we cannot enter until the designated time on the ticket. So we bought the ticket online, which is easier. You don't have to make the long queues because guys, trust me, the amount of crowds that are here, it's actually discouraging to go in. <laughs> but the good thing is you can book tours. There's also people here that can help you skip the line if you're willing to pay a fee. So yeah, there's those options. Um, so now what we're going to do is we're going to check the place out just uh, kind of take the pictures look at how beautiful it is behind me do you see it stunning one of those pieces of history that you definitely have to check out so um what we did is we bought tickets for the colosseum colosseum or colosseum i don't know how you say it uh colosseum and then uh, we also bought tickets for the palatine hill and um for the roman Forum. I think it's Roman Forum. So combined tickets. The tickets are for 33.5 or something. 33 euros, 30, 34 euros for two people. Filming is a challenge. So yeah, let me try and show you. The cross is there because at some point, actually till as recent as the 19th century, it was used by a religious uh, organization or a religious group. Don't say we didn't. I was your first love, and you were my first one. So this beautiful piece of art has been an amphitheater, which is what it's known for. It's been a church. It's been quarters. Like it's just been shifted over and over in just different centuries since the 1880 till now. So how fascinating is that? I don't know if you can see there, like that platform. So that was the arena. It fully covered the whole region there. And then that's the underground. As you've seen in movies, like at the underground as well, they keep people maybe in the dungeons. Because they used to also ex execute um, slaves from battles, like or soldiers they've captured uh, from battle. So they would definitely put them there. So that was the entire arena over there. So guys, now we are at the... Palatine Hill, we're heading to the Palatine Hill and the Roman Forum. So, this is the entrance. We just met by this grandiose. fascinating thing is you'll just walk in the streets of Rome and you'll just see like beautiful old historical buildings just there randomly you know just randomly Today is another day and it is our last last full day in Rome and it's about 10 right now we're just about to have breakfast and honestly I am exhausted I really am exhausted after all the travels and all the activities we've been doing so today we just want to do some very chilled things um, so we're heading out in my bag I've carried a bag um, a dress I forgot to film a reel uh, an ending of a reel so I've just carried the dress I was wearing yesterday so I can redo that and uh, yeah so follow me on Instagram as well so that you can check that out so what we're gonna do now is we're we're going to go to a different location and check out some other sites that we did not manage to check out and then um
Piazza Navona, surrounded by its restaurants and terraces, gives it a lively, delightful atmosphere. Definitely a place to have lunch, but remember the prices are a little bit costly, just for you to keep in mind. I hope you're doing well. Today is another day and today is the day we're leaving Rome. So yes, we're excited about that because we're heading to a, a different destination. So please stay tuned for that. Please make sure to hit, the, hit that subscribe button. Make sure to like this video and leave a comment down below. Have you been liking the Rome videos? 